So there's this thing in music theory called the altered scale, which is basically like, let's take the C scale for example, right? It's a... And the altered scale would probably, would basically alter all of the notes in the C scale. I'm actually not 100% on it, so don't take my word for it. Anyway, I found this little workaround that basically has the same sort of sonic effect as the altered scale without having to know the altered scale. So here's your little cheat for the day. All right, so the um, application for the altered scale, to my knowledge, is basically in substitution for the five, right? The five chord, so you'd be playing five. So let's say you're in C, right? So what you want to do is, sub uh, you play it over the five, so two, five, and then you play the altered scale. And then, so what I sort of cooked up was, um, let's stay in C, cause you know, what everybody knows so what we do here is we actually want to play the the four minor or basically the the six flat major scale as opposed to the actual altered scale because it has the same effect right so that's this, this is what this is going to sound like you want to go to one two three four we're on the f right and then we play the f minor scale which is also the a flat major scale so you know whatever tonic you want to choose it's the same thing so in application it would sound like 